What is cracking, spooling up, squad? We are out here today. We are headed to the track. Uh, it's giving the, the cars a nice little, little, bath. little bath here. Just real quickie, you know? But uh, got our gangster hood prop. Yeah, I think we should like, I think we should give a name to the hood prop and just keep it around. Yeah. Woody the, Woody the wood prop. Plank. Woody the wood prop. That's a thing. We got it. Woody the wood prop. And uh, we'll just use this because I didn't put the hood struts back on Dom's hood. But we're back in action with the track set up. And boy, oh boy, I'll tell you what, thing's going to rip. Dom, what, what do you think your trap speed is going to be? 130, 140. Mid-130s? One, one th mid mm -hmm. Maybe to start? Yeah. All right. I can get down with that. Uh, Corey, radials. Radials are in. They're, they're in. They're in the vet? They're in the vet, dude. Dude, that's, this is just a good old daily driver. It's fitting fitting tires and wheels in here. No big deal. And then we got the Speed 6. Getting prepped, ready to go. I just got out of work. And Dom's car in the back is loaded and ready to go. Dom, the car. It's locked. Okay. Oh, baby. All right, we got the meats. It's like Arby's in here. So we got the radials, jack, extra coolant, torque wrench i got tools in my car yeah we're kind of just touching on everything and we'll get ready to get out of here but it's gonna be a good night uh we're bringing all three cars i don't really i don't know depends on how busy it is there i think the lowest on priority is my speed six uh, i really want to get dom some runs in and get him dialed in shout out to uh trees for uh our wood hood prop woody the wood woody the hood prop, Woody's the hood prop. yeah but we're gonna get a cold start Get the cars warmed up and get ready to get out of here. Sender. cheese balls remember these yeah dude yeah so i mean i literally felt that yeah that's loud <laughs> i can only imagine what the two step the two steps gonna be stupid yeah all right so uh let's get out of here what do you guys say good go. all right all right guys so we made it out to the track we're just getting everything ready cars cooled off and getting everybody ready to go uh Corey's getting the wheels off the c6 and getting that thing ready we got dom's car up and cooling off getting all uh, tech cards ready to get teched in and we're gonna start getting the cars ready to go all right so radials are on we're just letting the uh, the car cool down a little bit we drove all the way here so we're gonna let temperatures get down let her cool off a good bit and then uh, jump up in the staging lanes and get ready to go Dom you ready oh, I'm, I'm ready I know you're ready so uh, hopefully we're gonna see we're gonna shake it down a little bit obviously we don't have slicks we just have radials so getting out the hole quick is gonna be hard uh but we're we're focused on trap speed today yeah. and Shaking hopefully hopefully we'll see some like 130s 140s not sure but we'll check it out and get ready to go so we'll see you guys in the staging lanes Corey's getting the radios on his vet now and uh once we're all ready we're gonna head up and get to it
Okay, so it's the next morning. Had a great time at the track. It was oh, a yeah. little a little chaotic. Very chaotic. It's <laughs> it's actually really difficult to run three cars and have people filming at the Very. same time. It's tough. Especially on um, a busy track day. Yeah, dude. It's, it wasn't like slow. It's rough. There was a lot of classes and a mm -hmm. lot of drivers, so it was kind of busy. I think you got like four or five runs. Only three. Three? Yeah, only oh, three. Oh, I thought it was more than that. See, that's that's how much I wasn't around yeah. him as I didn't know. It was um, crazy. Ran the six. I wasn't really too worried about it. I was just trying to figure some stuff out in it. Um, we were more concerned with Dom, and he did great. He got a little more comfortable with the car. Yep. Uh, he couldn't launch it yeah. because radials. Yeah, <laughs> Try, not trying to snap axles an hour away from home. Yeah, so yeah, we were at a, a track that was a little further out. We didn't have a truck and trailer, so we wanted to drive it home. Yes, for sure. This but, time. Uh, this week we got a track. Uh, we got a track like five minutes from us to oh, yeah. eighth mile. Practice launching there. Yeah, and uh, you know it's we're only gonna be able to do so much on the radials at yeah. the track, and when we get the the drag pack and the slicks, I think that'll be when we're gonna start you know fully sending it off the line. Yeah, and then you can just let it eat, dude, because. I mean, it's there. I think your best trap speed last night was 130. Yeah. So the, the mile an hour is there, and it would actually be more if the front half of the track was there. Yeah. Uh, you know, his his mile an hour in the front track, the front half of the track is probably about 10 to 15 mile an hour down from what it should be. Right. So I'd say 140s eventually. But uh, we're going to keep, you know, getting it dialed in and figure some stuff out. But we didn't break anything, so yeah, it it's good all night. good. And... We got the cars out here. We're just checking everything over. We actually had his uh, wastegate line. No. Uh, it's all push lock fittings. Uh, one of the wastegate lines actually like cracked and melted off the uh, the little fitting on the wastegate. So we just replaced that and it's good to go. Uh, Speed six actually made a shifter cable keeper plate for it to uh, prevent the shift cable from popping off. For some reason, the uh, the cable right here on top has an issue on my car popping off with hard shift so i built a little plate to cover it so we built a little plate keeper plate there it's got two holes with some washers and it. it basically goes over the top of that uh shifter cable um so keeps it in place and it should be good to go to send it so that's really it um we had a blast it was a good time and I think we're just going to prep ourselves for the next one and what's to come with the cars. We have a big update video coming on the Project MS8 for you guys. A lot of you guys are asking what's going on with it. I've kind of been in the dark with you guys of what's happening. But uh, I think I think we got to give them an update on what's right. going on. Um, a lot of big things. So many changes. Um, it'll be worth the wait, I'll tell you that. Uh, sure. This thing's going to come out swinging for the fence. <laughs> so it'll be definitely awesome. Uh, if, if you haven't seen what that car is about, go, go down in the videos and check out what we're doing with it. But I'll be putting an update video out on that here soon and uh, keep you guys updated. But we're going to leave it off at that. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and we will see you guys on the next one. Peace. Peace.